Hey guys! Today we'll be covering a 2022 romance miniseries called Love Starts from Marriage. The series begins with a wedding scene in which the father, Lee, walks his daughter, Shia Min, down the aisle. While walking, Lee tells his daughter to behave properly and not embarrass him as she has done in the past. Then, he places his daughter's hand on the groom's, telling him to take good care of her. After the ritual, the priest asks the groom to kiss the bride. But when the groom, Gu Cheng Zia, approaches Xia Min for a kiss, she is shocked to see him because she believes that she just slept with her twin sister's husband. The series then shifts to a bar one day earlier, where Min's twin sister, Sarah, is drinking with a random guy. The guy inquires as to why she is drinking excessively. She is then reminded of the previous day when she caught her boyfriend Wong sleeping with her best friend, Susu. Upon catching them red-handed, Susu reveals that she and Wong belong together. When the random guy hears this, he tries to take advantage of the situation, but Sarah leaves. While walking away, she feels dizzy because of all the drinks she's had. Soon after, a man pulls her into his room and asks why she drank so much. The man appears to be none other than Cheng Zia. Surprisingly, Sarah, who is extremely drunk, starts kissing him, and the two end up being intimate. The next day, Sarah awakens in Cheng Zia's bed, surprised to see him showering. She hurriedly dresses to leave. Cheng Zia tries to stop her, but in vain. When Sarah returns home, she learns that her sister Min has run away from her wedding. Her parents are upset because the wedding is only two hours away and cutting it off would be a total disgrace. According to the father, Lee, their company is experiencing capital turnover difficulties and without the support of Cheng Zia's family, they would be deeply in debt. In addition, he also might end up in jail. Left with no options, Sarah's parents tell her to take the place of Min and marry Cheng Zia. Her mother claims that the groom's family won't know about the bride's replacement because they're twin sisters. Hearing this, Sarah refuses and regrets returning from abroad. But when her parents emotionally blackmail her, she reluctantly agrees. This is how we come to learn that the bride in the opening scene is Sarah, who has taken her sister's place. In the next scene, we see Sarah's friend helping her with the wedding preparations. When the friend notices Sarah's upset, she consoles her by saying that it will all be over once Min is found. Sarah asks what will happen if Min can't be found, to which her friend advises her to stay with Cheng Zia because he is wealthy, handsome, and faithful. Back in the present, Sarah marries Cheng Zia, and at night, she is nervous because she can't stay together with her sister's future husband. She then looks for ways to avoid him on the wedding night. A few moments later, she notices Cheng Zia arrive and pretends to be on her period. Hearing this, he brings her various brands of sanitary products, showing his concern for her. Elsewhere, we see a popular star named Miss Jin at a press conference, where a news reporter questions her about why she broke up with Cheng Zia. However, Miss Jin doesn't reveal anything about her relationship. Back in his office, Cheng Zia tries to call his wife, but is unable to reach her. As a result, he sets out to find her. Meanwhile, Sarah is with a friend at a restaurant when Susu approaches her. She tries to clarify the relationship with Wong, but Sarah ignores her. A few moments later, Cheng Zia finds Sarah and addresses her as Min. Hearing this, Susu learns that Sarah is impersonating Min and decides to blackmail her. The next day, Cheng Zia discovers that the news of his relationship with Jin has gone viral on the internet. He also discovers that Jin has been posting heartbreaking posts on her social media, so he confronts her and tells her to stop. However, Jin dismisses him. Next, Sarah returns home to discover that Jin and Cheng Zia's private video has been leaked on the internet, which disappoints her. She also sees numerous negative comments about herself, causing her to become angry. Later, as soon as Cheng Zia returns home, Sarah screams at him, asking about the news. Cheng Zia tries to explain that there is no connection between Jin and himself, and that the news is fabricated. He also assures her that he will handle it properly, but Sarah believes that now is the best time to leave the house, so she does. Upon arriving home, Sarah asks her parents if they found Min, to which Lee responds that the police are working on it. In the next scene, Cheng Zia instructs his assistant to cancel Jin's endorsement and control the fake news as soon as possible. Later, an upset Jin approaches him and begs him not to cancel her endorsement. She also admits that she did everything because she loves him. Cheng Zia clarifies that he isn't interested in her and that he is now married. Despite this, Jin makes up her mind not to give up on him. Later that evening, Cheng Zia meets Sarah in a restaurant and makes her happy with a gift. One day as she walks across the street, some people bully Sarah, claiming that she's the third person to come between Cheng Zia and Jin. Just then, Cheng Zia arrives and saves her from the bullies. As the days pass by, Sarah slowly starts to appreciate Cheng Zia's loving and caring nature towards her. 
She, along with her friends, get drunk, and on their way home, they are approached by Susu, who intentionally pushes Sarah and steals her phone. Susu appears to be envious of Sarah's marriage to a wealthy man, so she decides to deprive her of her happiness. Sarah's friends tell her to get into the car, and at the same time, Cheng Zia notices this. He punches one of her male friends, believing he is bullying Sarah, and takes her home. The next morning, Sarah awakens to find her clothes have changed. She approaches Cheng Zia and asks if he changed her clothes, to which he responds yes. This startles her, but she decides to ignore it. Before leaving, the caring husband gives her a beautifully designed scissor as a gift and warns her not to get drunk. Later at work, Jin invites Cheng Zia to dinner, and when he declines, she persuades him by mentioning his wife's best friend, who was unable to attend their wedding. The same night, Cheng Zia takes Sarah to a restaurant where they meet Jin and Susu. The latter tries her best to expose Sarah's secret of impersonating Min. She calls Sarah's number, but to her surprise, the call is not answered. It is revealed that Sarah cleverly switched her phone with Min's, making Susu and Jin look foolish. After witnessing this, Chengzi warns them to stay away from his wife. But now, Chengzi has also started to doubt his wife's identity, as he hasn't seen her twin sister for a while. The next day, Chengzi introduces Sarah as the new designer head for his company, making Jin envious. Later, the couple goes to a cafe to have coffee together, and while Cheng Zia is buying coffee, Sarah is approached by her ex-boyfriend Wong. He addresses her as Sarah, but she responds that she's Min. However, he claims that he knows her well because they've been together for a long time. Furthermore, he says that Sarah has a special scar on her body. He also blackmails her, leaving her with no choice but to comply with his demands for money. In the evening, Cheng Zia is walking across the street with his wife when he hears a sad song. He asks her if she remembers the song, to which she responds that she isn't interested in such songs. This makes him realize that his wife is deceiving him, as Min mentioned that she loved sad songs. Despite learning the truth, he is unable to confront her. Cheng Zia goes to a bar and gets drunk. A while later, his assistant is helping him return home when they are approached by Jin, who convinces Cheng Zia's assistant to take him to a nearby hotel. As soon as his assistant leaves, Jin sneaks into the room and sleeps with Cheng Zia. Meanwhile, Sarah prepares a delicious dinner for her husband, but sadly, he doesn't show up. The next morning, a picture of Cheng Zia sleeping with Jin goes viral on the internet, which makes Sarah upset. Cheng Zia is enraged and instructs his assistant to terminate Jin's contract. On the other hand, Jin approaches Sarah and reveals that Cheng Zia is already aware of her secret. In the next scene, a worried Sarah goes to Cheng Zia and asks if he intends to divorce her. Surprisingly, Cheng Zia tells her to pretend to be Min until her father's business recovers from the financial crisis. After that, she can get back to him with a reasonable explanation. Later, Sarah informs her parents about the divorce, causing Lee to faint and become hospitalized. As a result, and ultimately, regain his trust. The following day, Cheng Zia holds a press conference to explain his innocence and confess his love for his wife. Sarah also tells everyone that she loves her husband and kisses him in front of everyone. After the conference, Sarah asks for permission to compete in the National Runway Show, representing his company, to which Cheng Zia agrees. But there is one catch. If she loses the competition, he will ensure that her father's business collapses. Elsewhere, Jin goes live on social media claiming that her relationship with Cheng Zia is real. She also prepares a false pregnancy report and announces that she's pregnant with Cheng Zia's child. When Sarah hears this news, she goes to the bar and gets drunk in order to forget everything. Just then, Cheng Zia approaches Sarah and tries to explain his innocence, but he has no evidence to back up his claim. Despite this, Sarah believes that it will be hopeless even if she helps Gu's company win the show because she has also lied to him. The next day, Sarah devises a plan and sends her male friend to speak with Jin. According to the plan, Sarah's male friend offers Jin a job and persuades her to prepare a medical report for it. Then, Sarah follows Jin to the hospital and films her bribing the doctor to modify her pregnancy report. Once the coast is clear, Sarah complains to the senior doctor about it and obtains the original report, revealing Jin's fabricated pregnancy. She then hands over the original report to Chen Zia, who reveals it to the media, proving his innocence. Cheng Zia wants to thank Sarah for her assistance, but he is unable to do so. Later that day, Sarah walks home alone after working late. On her way, she is being followed by several strangers, which alarms her. Meanwhile, Cheng Zia is unable to resist himself, so he calls Sarah. 
He then learns about the strangers and rushes over to her location. But before he can reach the location, his father, Tony's men, rescue her from the strangers and take her away. At home, Tony slaps Sarah for deceiving the Gu family. Shortly after, Cheng Zia arrives and Tony orders him to get rid of her. But to his surprise, Cheng Zia refuses to divorce her, claiming that he still needs her. After the altercation, Cheng Zia drives her to the hospital where her father is being treated. While entering the hospital, she is reminded of all the chaos that's happening in her life, causing her to faint. A little while later, she regains consciousness and notices her male friend in front of her. At the same time, Cheng Zia also arrives, and when he sees Sarah with her male friend, he becomes envious. He then abducts the man and questions him about his relationship with Sarah. As expected, the terrified man claims they're just friends. He also reveals that the person Cheng Zia fell in love with is actually Sarah, not Min. Saying this much, he starts describing their first encounter. The man claims that Min vanished that day, so Sarah had to reluctantly take her place. Hearing all this, Cheng Zia becomes emotional and rushes towards Sarah. He then expresses his feelings for her from the very beginning and asks for another chance. Following this, we are taken to the National Runway Show where Cheng Zia is feeding his wife before the event. However, Jin and Susu have mixed sedatives into the food, causing her to faint during the show. Sarah is then rushed to the hospital, where the doctors reveal that she is out of danger. Meanwhile, Susu puts out a press release about Sarah's allergic reaction. She also reveals that Cheng Zia's wife's name is Sarah and not Min. The following day, a news reporter gathers outside the hospital to inquire about the bride's replacement. Fed up with everything, Cheng Zia proposes marriage to Sarah, her true identity, and the whole madness ends once and for all. In the next scene, we see Wong keeping an eye on Jin at a bar. He puts sedatives in her drink and photographs himself sleeping with her. Following that, he contacts someone to inform them that the job has been completed. It is revealed that Cheng Zia gave Wong 500,000 won to get back at his ex-girlfriend for all the troubles she caused him. At last, Cheng Zia and Sarah have a romantic time in bed, indicating that they are ready to be with each other for the rest of their lives.